China was the first one that was hit by the known pandemic that hits the whole world. But fortunately, they are the first country that is able to recover fast from the effects of COVID-19. And now, they are back on track with their most amazing super engineering works that you cannot see in other countries. Watch! Hi everyone, how's it going? Richard Aguilar here again and I'm back with another awesome video for you. So, before we start, don't forget to subscribe and smash the bell icon so that you will always be updated with our new videos. Now, this is what it looks like when China resumes their super engineering works after recovering fast from COVID-19 pandemic. Take a look. Number 1. Here is the intelligent highway under construction in Zhejiang, China. It's a real dream of transportation experts that vehicles on highways will be wirelessly connected to the advanced computerized system that will boost safety, avoid possible accidents, and reduce congestion. Fortunately, an intelligent highway is under construction in Zhejiang, China, which upon completion will be able to support tests of smart connected vehicles. Number 2 is Chuanzhou Xiamen Bridge joined its two sections. Here is another achievement in China when it comes to their amazing super engineering capabilities. Chuanzhou Xiamen Bridge joined its two sections, marking the completion of the cross sea bridge connecting the three most important cities, which are Chuanzhou, Xiamen, and Fuzhou in southeast China's Fujian. Number three is the construction for major sea crossing transportation projects. Construction is underway on a part bridge, part tunnel transport link that will stretch for 24 kilometers connecting the Chinese mainland cities of Shenzhen and Jiangshan in the Pearl River Delta. Workers submerged the first section of what is expected to be one of the world's widest undersea tunnels. The Shenzhen Junction transport link is due to be ready in 2024 and is a key project meant to support the economy of the surrounding Greater Bay Area. Number 4 is the prefabricated isolation rooms for South Korea. A Chinese enterprise delivers prefabricated isolation rooms to South Korea for battling against COVID-19 pandemic. These are special wards for victims of coronavirus. All of these portable-looking isolation rooms were assembled in Hunan, China.
Important efforts were done to make sure that before delivery, everything in these facilities will work fine according to plan. They also made sure that all sanitary wear products are waterproof for the prevention of the spread of the disease. Number 5 is track laying completed for new high-speed rail in Anhui, China. This is how China builds and lays rail tracks for high-speed railways. Track laying was now completed for a new high-speed railway in Anhui, China. China is creating a network of amazing land and sea-based transport links to connect its ever-increasing economy with those of nearby cities and regions. Number 6 is Track Laying on Beijing-Hong Kong High-Speed Rail Section Progress has been made in construction of the Beijing-Hong Kong High-Speed Rail Cafe Anqing Section. The section has a length of 162 km with a design speed of 350 km per hour. No matter what kind of pandemic outbreak they experienced before, the work still continues. And now that the COVID-19 eases away, they focus even more on how to accomplish what they've started. Number 7 is China building its first undersea high-speed rail tunnel. Constructors and workers in this mega project are working around the clock to build China's first undersea high-speed railway tunnel in Xinjiang, East China. Once this project is done, this will be the first of its kind in China that the world will see. Number 8 is China Laos Railway Bridge completes closure over Mekong River. Closure of the main section of the Ben Ladon Mekong River Super Major Bridge is finished, meaning both cross Mekong bridges along the railway have completed their major engineering work. As the first overseas route connecting China railway system, the China Laos Railway is a major project in implementing the Belt and Road Initiative. Number 9. Construction of Xiangen New Area is back on fast track. As the outbreak of the novel coronavirus has been basically contained in China, 
the construction of Xiangen, often billed as China's city of the future, has resumed in an orderly manner. And that's all there is to it for today's video. So if you found this video wonderful, please give us a like, subscribe, and share this with others. And once again, this is Richard Aguilar. Thanks for watching and see you on my next video.